back on the grind to infinity rank. Boy, it's been a grind, but we are back in S8. I can't remember if we hit S8 last video or if that happened while I was just playing off camera, but we find an infinite four player. Snoop Dogg, a couple other S ranked players. This should be a pretty good game, I think. I mean, I've been playing, or I've already played a few games today. They didn't go really well, so hopefully those were just, I mean, they were warm up games, but hopefully it was just the warm up games. It's not like, you know, how I'm playing today, but let's focus up here. Good chance at some rank if we win. Nice shot. Going five iron here. No spin because the pins went at the back. That's a fine approach. I mean, when it's pretty strong, right to left wind on hole two, pin right side, pin position, it's difficult, so. Yeah, that is a fine birdie and a good start to the round and the video. Probably just gonna see mostly birdies there. Yeah, five and three. That's fine, tied for first here. On to hole three we go. When the very first hole of an online game is hole two, the next hole is always going to be hole three. It's the way the, uh, I guess it's like kind of RNG in a way, but there's only, you can only have like, I mean, it's just the way the game is set up. Nice shot. So I guess in this case it's not RNG, but. You know, the way like, I mean, I don't even know what Nintendo's Freaking code in this game is. But anyway, more strong wind. Nice shot. Okay, clipping the tree there, dropping down to the rough. That's fine though. We just gotta, I mean, yeah, obviously we can still birdie this, no problem. Just gonna be a little bit more difficult because we're farther away and on the rough. But I'll do some backspin here, play it safe. Okay, yeah, that's actually fine. 109 yards from the rough with the wind on hole three. 11 foot approach is good. Should be another free birdie here at least. Okay, and it is nice. Okay, five way tie going into round two. All tied on 20. Ooh, no hole seven. Is this zero wind? Okay, it actually is. Wow. What are the chances of a chip in eagle? What's the pin? Back left. Okay, there's actually a chance. I've gotten a few eagles from this pin position. It's a little bit finicky. Like, you gotta be really, really precise. But I'm gonna do spoon here. Three dots on the spoon and, like, a few ticks to the left. It's kind of what you... The general adjustment for uh, eagle on this pin position. But again, it's like... I don't know exactly how many ticks to go to the left. The three dots on the spoon will be fine from where we are. Oh, that's too much power, actually. Shoot, that is actually way too much power. Unless... Okay, no, we literally skipped right over the hole. Yeah, that's... Shoot. Nice on. Aim was actually pretty good. Like we, I think we would have landed in the hole if we had the power. Good birdie though. Nice birdie. Well, seven will take birdie all day. Okay, we got hole eight next. Four mile an hour wind. Middle pin position here. You won't get. I want to go five iron, like three and a half ish with backspin. Nice shot. A little less here because of the wind. It's kind of a tailwind. Okay, no, I'm way too far left. Never mind. Mm, yeah, it's, I mean, what are we, 2.6 feet away? It's not a bad approach, but... No, no eagle here, no hole-in-one. I think we're still just going to be tied, like the deadlock's not been broken yet. Yeah, I mean, other than KG, who had the par on 7. It's four-way tie. We, could there be a four-way closest to pin? There actually very well might be. 
Ooh, okay, it's 17. Now I'm there's definitely not gonna be a full way close to spin here. I guarantee there's gonna be birdies and pars here. Wind kind of looks strong ish. We'll see what the pin position's like. Okay, wind's actually not that strong. Pin's on the left, so this is actually probably a fine birdie for me. I think for most of the other players, too. Nice shot. Ooh, a little light there on that one. Nice one. But I'm actually on like a really flat part of the green, so even though it's 30 footer, this is a free birdie, which is uh, fine. No eagles, so if I sink this birdie, I'll at least tie for first. Yeah, there's a good birdie there on 17. Okay, two-way. Closest to pin here. Tied on 50. Pretty close game up until the end. I mean, 50's a fine score. It was a decent seed. We're on hole 11 here. Is this zero wind? Pretty sure it is. So it's almost... This is just like a normal... We're on the tee box, too. So this is just like a normal... Okay, and it's back left pin. So this is literally just like five iron, three dots, one tick to the right. Bang. Zero foot approach. Might as well just say bang right now, get it over with. It's either a free win or a tie. Let's. Ooh, is that going in? Oh, okay. That, like. Buddy, like, lipped. He, like, nicked the hole, but he was going so slow. I'm surprised he didn't drop in there. That is crazy. What a closest to pin. One and a half feet. Jeez. Any other closest to pin one and a half foot would win, like, every time. Unless you're playing Grandpa Chad. And that is a, uh... Yeah, that's a GG. Could win. Good closest to pin. How much rank are we gonna get here? Okay, it's actually a pretty decent amount. We're halfway through rest aid. Let's jump into a second game here for the video. I will see you there. Game number two, coming off that clutch CTP win, we there's four other S players, a couple A players and a B player. It's an okay lobby, I wouldn't say there's as much rank up for grabs as there was last game, but at least if we win this one, it'll still be worth our time. One. So, let's focus up here. We're uh, clawing back to S9, which is nice, and then the, obviously from there it's just off to infinity, so... Nice shot. Let's just focus on winning this game. Full 10, 11 mile an hour wind. Okay, wow. Power was really good, actually. Nice approach. Would have been a very nice eagle, but... Freaking eight feet to the right there, jeez. Did not read the wind right, but another good birdie to start off the round. It's really, you know, unless we're playing some like freaking Tiger Woods guy, an eagle in the first hole's all you need, or an eagle, a birdie. Hole 11 once again, what if we just replicate what we did at the CTP and get a hole in one? I'll do five iron here again. Ooh, 17 mile an hour wind proves to be a little bit too tough there for us for that hole in one. Nice approach though, good birdie. Er yeah, okay, now a good birdie. Let's assume there's gonna be a good birdie, but I mean, there's always a chance to micro putt, so. Okay, a lot less birdies there. Three way tie, Jaco Corleone. Why is Corleone the name that you would see on some girl in an infomercial trying to sell you like a uh, core workout like an ab roller you know 1999 but wait there's more if you call Corleone right now you can get two ab rollers 1999 
back on seven. Ooh, pin position. I guess actually we could totally do spoon here. I wonder. I'd have to go less power because the wind's a little bit of a tailwind. I guess the problem with, they're not the problem, but the downside to spoon strategies is like, you're so used to chipping with an iron, nice you uh, kind of, you know how much to adjust for the wind with an iron, but I don't really know how much to adjust for different strengths of wind with the spoon, because, you know, I don't have a lot of practice with it, so I guess, yeah, a little too far to the right there off that wind, but that's fine. Another bird, that's fine. We'll take it. Not, I mean, the lobby wasn't, well, I guess there were some S rank, but not, it wasn't, not too concerned about my play this game. Okay, actually no other birdies there, so that is going to put me out in the lead by three points, and our infomercial girl got a triple bogey there? I wasn't really paying attention. That's kind of sad, though. RIP. But first place right now by three points. Two holes left, we're on, uh, what is this, uh, nine? I was gonna say like 20 or something. Really strong wind, I wonder, it's a little bit of a tailwind. Okay, didn't mean to red bar it. I was gonna say, cause it's a little bit of tailwind, I was wondering if we could make it onto the green in two, but it's like definitely not possible. What is the carry of the drivers in this game? I've never really paid attention to how far each club goes. But if, like, if Grandpa Chad isn't carrying 400 plus yards, then this game's obviously pretty inaccurate. Nice shot. But yeah, I'm just gonna, I mean, pins over on the kind of top left, so if I go over here, then, uh, bonk, we should, I mean, yeah. I feel like I'm, I'm have a better chance of making an eagle here than if I was, like, before the water where you normally go, so... Ooh, is that good? Ooh, not quite, okay. Nice hunt. 15 footer, should be able to sink this, but we also do have that cushion, that three point lead, so if I par either here or the final hole, it's not the end of the world. That's a nice birdie though. Put me on 40 after four. Okay, there it is, off to the final with a six point lead. Well, 16 here should be fine. I mean, even if someone gets a chip and eagle and I get a birdie, I'll still win. So all I gotta do, birdie this, 16, and uh, that would be the dub. We'll try to eagle though. Looks like the wind would definitely take the shortcut, so maybe a cheeky chip from the bunker to seal the deal, we'll see. Nice shot. Okay, no, not really that close. Nice approach. Nice bird. Good bird there, good 50 points. I guess that'll put me make, make it two 50 point performances and two Ws and a six point lead. It's definitely not gonna be as much rank as we got last game, but it should still be an okay amount. There were a few, they were lower ranked S players, but there were four S players, so let's see. And, okay, that's all right. Not too bad. I'll see you in game number three. Game number three. Okay, one infinite player and then a D player, bruh. Three B players, two S players. Okay, I mean, what a uh, interesting lobby. Should be another pretty good game, though, I'm assuming. We have the infinite player. Couple uh, S players. I'll do seven down here with backspin on hole 13. Nice shot. Okay, that's, I, that's too little power. I meant to give it, like, just under full power. Hmm. Nice song. 25 feet, yikes. Fuck, uh, yeah, okay. 
Got some work to do for the birdie here. We really do not want to be falling behind, like, literally the first hole, so... Gotta make sure we sink this putt. Nice okay, very nice birdie. Four-way tie for first, everyone else on seven. Ooh, and on to 14. With what looks like a really strong wind. Can we make it on the green in two, putt for an eagle? That's the question here. Okay, I don't know if we can generate enough power here. We'll see. We'll just do full driver. That red bar kind of screwed me over a little bit. Lost a few yards. Nice shot. Oh, wow. Okay, shoot. Man, that actually would have been enough power. It's a little bit surprising. I wasn't expecting that much power. But, like, just got the wind wrong. A couple more feet to the left. It would have been fine. Left chipping, though, to save Eagle from the bunker. There's a chance. We're only 22 yards. Shouldn't be too bad. But dang, similarly to last, so I don't want to be falling behind just on the second hole here going into the semis. It, ooh, shoot. Just lift there. Nice dang it. Okay, good news for us, no eagles there. That lift there isn't gonna cost me. Still tied with the infinite player and one of the S players actually. And on to seven. Oh, we got seven with zero wind again. It's actually kinda crazy. Okay, it's not zero wind, but. It's only two mile an hour wind, very, very close. Pins right side, so no spoon this time. We'll do three iron. Nice shot. Add some backspin here. And Okay, that's fine. Nice home. Sub ten foot, full seven. Good birdie there. Okay, looks like Eagles jersey dropping off, so I'm still tied with the infinite player on 30. Five points over Eagle. Went on to hole eight. Is this zero wind? I think it is. It is zero wind. Ooh, pin at the back too. Nice. I'm doing spoon here. Should be around like 2.2 dots of power. Just not exactly sure the aim. Like maybe... I don't actually know. I think I'll just leave the aim straight and just see where we end up. Okay, what am I even doing? That is way too light. Imagine being 20 feet away off hole 8 from, uh, uh, with zero wind. Way, way, way too light there. Bruh. Too much power. Too much power. How the heck do I bogey? I literally tried to get a micro putt on that that uh, par putt there. Like I wanted to get micro putt glitched on hole on that par putt because I adjusted so far to the left. That's why I did it, and then. The game just gave me a normal swing, like an absolute troll. That's crazy. Final round. Pretty big meltdown on the fourth hole there. I mean, hole 19 though. If like, if we if if we need a five point comeback, at least it's a tough special hole, you know.
Nice shot. Ah, uh, it's too little too late, isn't it? Nice birdie on 19, but... See, man, like, this is her par putt. Like, if I literally just got a par on hole 8 with zero wind, I would have been going to a closest pin, but instead I had to, uh... You know? Bogey her up. Dang, that's crazy. Well, second place, it's definitely going to eat into uh, some of the gain we got early, earlier this video. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, it's tough. Still about halfway through S8, though, so we are definitely finishing the video net positive. If you enjoyed, do hit the like button, and I will see you guys in the next video.